Hello friends, welcome to Amama's Rasui World. Today I am going to share a very nice recipe of coffee cake. This is no oven, no egg recipe. So let's get started. This is very yummy and spongy coffee cake. So I have taken a big bowl and in this big bowl I am going to put one and half one tablespoon coffee powder, instant coffee powder. I have already put now I am going I am adding milk one cup of milk to it and now sugar two tablespoon sugar and condensed milk two tablespoon condensed milk and two tablespoon vegetable oil any kind of white refined oil I am putting here sunflower oil so two tablespoon sunflower oil or any kind of refined oil and I am putting plain flour just normal flour I am putting six tablespoon plain flour one teaspoon baking powder and half teaspoon bicarbonate soda or baking soda mix all the ingredients very nicely until lump free I have already added 6 tablespoon plain flour but it looks a little thin so I am adding 2 more tablespoon plain flour so altogether 8 tablespoon plain flour so mixing it very nicely now my mixing is done you can see the thickness it is it should be a little thicker see how thick it is so the consistency should be like this also adding half teaspoon salt to it half teaspoon salt So mix it very nicely. Now I have taken this steel bowl to make the cake and I am greasing with the oil very nicely and dusting with the plain flour all around the bowl very nicely. Like this. And throw away the extra dust or extra flour look so this is ready now I'm putting the cake mixture to this bowl so this is ready now now if you want you can let see the mixture for a while then for a while or, or you can straight away cook it I have turned on the gas and I have taken a big pan and putting a small plate upside down and put this cake mixture and covering it nicely with another bowl and I have to cook in low steam 
for 30 minutes now let's check after 30 minutes it's rising up it looks so good so this is almost ready now I have to check whether it is ready or not so I have turned off the gas so I'm checking with this wooden stick yeah it is done so run a knife around the bowl to take out the cake and put turn upside down in a plate like this see how easily it will come out you can see yes see how easily it came out so you can see a little bit burned so I have don't worry I have to cut it out so I have taken a sharp knife to cut it out so see I have cut in cut out the burnt part so I'm now going to start icing for that I have put hazelnut spread I have put already I have covered with hazelnut spread a whole cake now I'm going to put strawberry jam whipping the strawberry jam nicely until mixed very nicely putting in this tube so I'm going to put the strawberry jam in this tube and I'm putting it you can use any thing if you uh, of your choice now I'm just decorating like this I'm going to give a marble effect so doesn't matter whatever jam however way you decorate finally you have to mess it up that means marble effect so it shouldn't be that perfect so already I have put I have put condensed milk and now with the jam and condensed milk I am giving the marble effect like this with the help of this wooden stick you can see this and I have made buttercream icing just I have whipped butter with icing sugar and I got this texture and I have put this buttercream around the cake and decorated like this very easy spoon design with the help of this plastic spoon I have decorated this this is very easy anybody can do this if you want you can yeah, use like this but I need little more decoration so I have taken a piping bag and I have put the butter cream and decorating like this so my decoration is almost done but finally I'm going to add the strawberries to look beautiful Look, I have cut the strawberries into halves and putting on top of the cream. Wow, look how nice it is. Please let me know how do you find it. Look, I'm cutting it, and this is very spongy and tastes yum look 
how spongy it is. So there you go. My cake is served. You can see the texture very nice. Soft yummy cake. Spongy. Very nice. So easy to cook. So thanks for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe, share and like my channel MMS Recipe all by now.